Hey there, internet best friends. Look who I'm here with. Hello. There we go. You feel better now, don't you? I was waiting for it to come out. What are we doing today? We are going to be predicting your future uh -huh. um, in a unique way called MASH. MASH. Now, we were tagging this video by Tyler Oakley, who I haven't met yet, but you have. I have. He's a lovely, lovely he, guy. He's got the kind of face I just want to hug. Not just his face, his whole body. <laughs> but I like him. And he was in that video with uh, Ingrid, who's Miss Glamorazzi, who I love to pieces. So. Um, well, I'd love to see you hug him, actually, because you're about... Your head's about on the ceiling, and yeah. he's about... Down there. So really? I'd pick him up. Oh, I'd pick him up and just give him a little squeeze. Okay, so the idea of MASH is firstly, it's a bit of a confusing game. On the piece of paper, you write the letters that spell MASH, which stand for Mansion, Apartment, Shack, or House. Next, you need to write the first category, which is Wife, or if you're a girl, Husband. husband. Now, because this is my future, I'm going to throw in two things that I'd quite like to happen, and Marcus is going to throw in two things that he'd I'd quite like, like to, to happen. see happen to you. <laughs> okay, so the first person that I'm going to have, that I'm going to marry, will of course be Tanya Burr, who I'm already engaged to. Oh, How cute. Awkward if you don't get her, though. Okay, and your second wife? The Queen. The Queen. And the two people I'm going to throw in for you are Susan Boyle. Nice. And... The tampon girl. Is this the person that eats a tampon? Yeah. I haven't, I've, re <laughs> I've refused to watch it because, is it even around still? Or has it been like, removed? I don't know, but I didn't see it on YouTube. All I do know is that I showed it to my whole family on my skin. Oh god. Okay, so the next category is occupation. Okay. I would quite like to be uh, a YouTuber, please. My second one, I would like to be an artist, but kind of like a comic book designer, sort yeah, of illustrator. Yeah, you're good at drawing, aren't Yeah, you? I like to draw. I didn't know you could draw till the other day when you are like, these are my drawings. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna give you is a male prostitute. Good. I think that would be amusing to see you as a male. Well, I <laughs> say that. I'm using and riddled with risk <laughs> and potential disease. I spelled that right, prostitute. I don't think it matters at this point. The fact is I'm gonna be a prostitute. Fingers crossed that one doesn't come up. The Pope. The Pope? The Pope. Well, we do need a new Pope. We do, we? exactly. So I, I could be pope. that guy. There you go. <laughs> I, only I couldn't be a prostitute and a Pope. <laughs> <laughs> I so want you to be a prostitute. <laughs> I don't, I really don't. The next category is how many children we're going to have. Now, this could be a tampon girl. <laughs> I'm hoping uh, with Tarn or the Queen, that'd be quite amazing. No! It? <laughs> I'm going to say I want two children. One boy, one girl, please. And what's your next option? Four. Two boys, two girls. Four. I don't like odd numbers. <laughs> they upset me. Right, so you hate odd numbers, so I'm going to give you 13. Is that in one birth? One birthing load? Ooh. Because I have got super sperm, but I do... I, I, I worry for whoever is bearing those children. And I'm going to give you the, the, just the one. Location of where you're going to live, so what city would you like to live in? I would quite like to live in New York. Uh, New York! Second one? London. Londinium. Landa. Landa. I'm going to give you... The North Pole be a brilliant place to raise 13 children. It'd be an amazing place to be a prostitute, I imagine. <laughs> Business is heaving. <laughs> and then I'm feeling nice. I'm gonna go to LA. And finally, the last one is your method of transportation. Okay, um, I would like to have roller skates and a husky. Get like some sort of harness and just go, go! Like that, and it just takes some places. Roller. Roller husky. The husky's name has to be like something badass, like Storm! Or Rider, Lightning. I'm trying to think of a good name. Um, Bob. Second method is. I was gonna say spaceship, but kind of seems a bit. Why not? Well, this it's, is it's the seem, future. It doesn't seem very economical, really. I'm gonna give you transportation of. You know, like the little cars that, like my grandma has one. <laughs> <laughs> grandma Bill. I'm okay. It. I like that. Your second mode of transport is a tractor. Okay, next step is Marcus has to draw lots and lots of lines and I have to tell him when to stop and then we'll tell you the next bit then. Going. Stop! Okay, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Count through and every ninth item you remove from that list and that is dis disregarded from my future and will never ever happen no matter what. Sorry, you're not going to have your roller husky. Oh man. You're not going to be a YouTuber. Sorry. Might as well give up now. <laughs> oh, you're not gonna be living on the North Pole. Oh, what? You're not gonna be marrying the tampon girl. You're not gonna be marrying the queen. Does that sadden you? Well, it kind of does, but I think she's on her way out anyway. So it's either Tanya or Susan Boyle right now. Oh, God, tough, tough call. Oh, you're not gonna be a prostitute. <laughs> okay, I have got your future predicted out. Do you wanna hear it? Let's hear it. Here okay, so that you are going to be marrying 
Thanks, Tanya Bear. Yeah. <laughs> That's yes. just fate right there. Yes. Right thanks, thanks, Susan, for rejecting me. So your confirmed job is the Pope. Yeah. <laughs> How do you feel about being I always, the new Pope? I always knew I had a higher calling. <laughs> if there's anything I'm going to stop YouTube for, it's, it's to be the religious leader of the world. You can have two babies. You are going to be living in an apartment. You're unfortunately going to have a mode of transportation as a tractor. Okay. So a trip down to the local shops might be interesting. Okay. And you're going to be living in London. Okay, so that is it. That's it. Um, this is my last ever YouTube video because apparently I'm going to be the Pope. You're going to be the Pope. And I can't be on the internet ever again. No. Nope. So, Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to give this video a big like and a thumbs up and a comment and subscribe and all that stuff. And click on Marcus because you'll go to his channel. If you don't already know who he is, then you quite frankly are a bit silly. Make sure you check out all of his videos and thumbs them all up. I paid him to say that. <laughs> Thanks, Jim. And also, you will be seeing the version of this on my channel mm -hmm. very soon. We love you and we will see you really, really soon. Goodbye. Bye.